so all right so here we have a mini moto i do not know what model it is but uh redcircles.co.uk that's all it says uh front suspension is seized as fuck doesn't move for shit um the brakes uh, mechanical disc that's what you're gonna get though um i could i could possibly change the front hydraulic and leave the rear disc mechanical um the pull start is kind of dead basically the the return cable thing has come out and i don't know how to put it back in so tomorrow i'm gonna have to try sort that out and put it back in see if i can start it grease through green tracks um i'm probably gonna put some new bars on it keep it as is mostly it's got a massive fuel leak fuel is actually not leaking anymore it's not leaking So, Tom, I hope you're watching this, because it is a beast. It is quite a beast. Uh, there's play in the rear shock. Look, I can... Look how much play there is. And I need to find a bolt that will quickly go in there. A bolt that will go through. Well, actually, I've just seen that. I probably could not do that. I don't know what to do with it, though, the rear shock. Maybe if I get one... If I get some nylon bushing, I could put that in there, and then it might work. But it's pretty squishy. It is for kids. Um, but yeah, it's got it's got front and back brakes. I think I was running it too rich. Shut up, man! I'm doing a YouTube video anyway. Um, I think I cross-fed this fuel tank as well. Yeah, there's barely any fuel in there. Uh, she's running dry. Look at that. Probably run out of fuel, that's why it broke down on the road. Getting it from Tom's house to here. Fuck. Dead because it's got no return. But yeah, so. This is my new Mini Moto project. That's pretty cool. I need to tighten the headset and that. Um, but yeah, so. Yeah, that's my Mini Moto. You're already going to see more videos on this. So it's pretty, it's pretty small. Let me go p compare it to like. I mean, I'll compare it to a BMX. I mean, it'll be, it'll look very different, size-wise, to a BMX. Um, it's pretty illegal, but I don't actually care. So this is it compared to a BMX. Right, let me get it in there quickly. Let me just that's it compared to a BMX. I mean look at the size of that. That's the GT and that's the mini moto. This is just my BMX. But yeah, I need to uh, fix a return cable for the pull start. I don't know how to do it, but I reckon I'll manage if I do it with Tom tomorrow. Not Tom as in bike Tom, TC bot. My mate Tom McKinnon, you could probably help me out with it. Throttle was getting a bit stuck. I could change the throttle. And there's massive play in the bars, which is very, very dodgy. So we're just gonna tighten that up quickly. Um there we go. If we just tighten these up a bit. That's loosening the fucking out. Big plane here. Where it's coming from? Headrock, that's the one. I need to sort the headrock out, but this kill switch is in the way, so. Oh no, it's not. You can just move that out the way. And then you could tighten that, I suppose. See if I can. Get a spanner. Dead adjustable. Here's the 
working on. I'll probably have to take the bars off and then tighten it because the fuel tank's getting in the way a bit. Unless I can do it from over here. Nope, cannot. So yeah, I'll just do all this tomorrow. I'm not going to even replastic it, I'm just going to get the seat to stay. Um, I'm going to get these big ass rental bars for it though. That'll be, that'll be sick. So, um, yeah. I wonder if these. I wonder if these are tight. Oh dear! I rode this from. I don't know. Um, I need another spanner, but I'm not doing that tonight. But uh, yeah. So the mini moto, it broke down twice. I think, and the cylinder head got very, very hot. I just think the carb needs to clean. And the filter needs to go on there too, but I could... But it cannot... Works on that, moves inside. Just... Needs a bit of... Adjustment, really, with the air-to-fuel ratio as well. But it does run, we know it runs, which is very good news. So I rode it from through the back roads. Yeah, I rode it through the back roads. The front brake is pretty dodgy. Well, it's not dodgy, it works, but yeah, the, the, the calipers and that need cleaning, they feel all grimy and schmooey. The schmoo all on them. Chain's nice and tight. But it does run. I've I've ridden it. The exhaust needs its thing put back on because that's pretty dead as well. Uh, but yeah, this is my new mini motor. We're gonna have so much fun with this. Probably gonna take it rally sport. If you don't know what rally sport is, it's this thing, it's basically mechanic school. But I don't know how to do the carburetor or anything, so I'm probably not gonna do that. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this though. But it's a mini moto, so I could get some bushes to go inside there because there's shock play. And when I sit on it, it bottoms out because fat. No, I'm joking. Um, but yeah. So yeah, that's my mini moto. It's pretty cool. Thank you for watching. See you later.